Hi, I'm Father Francis Gustilo, as additional priest of Don Bosco. I'd like to share with you my reflection on the Holy Spirit as the main life giver of everything in the world, including our Christian faith. This will be taken in the life of our Christian faith in Faith Matters. The Holy Spirit, it's so difficult to say, who is He? Because when you talk about the three persons, people have an experience of being a father. I have an experience of being a son. But the Spirit seems to be very ambiguous or ambivalent. But the Spirit is the essence of relationship, kindredness, sense of belonging. And you know, that's what happened inside the life of the Trinity. The Father and the Son are mutually related because of the Spirit between them. The Spirit is the love of the Father and the love of the Son for each other. He is love. And love can only happen when there is a deep and intimate relationship. Now, that love, that is the Spirit, was given to the world. Long before Christ came into this world, the Spirit was sent. If you remember in Genesis chapter 1, there was this divine wind that hovered over the abyss. Many fathers of the church look at that as the Spirit, the Spirit of the Father and of Christ. That Spirit pervaded the whole universe, the whole of creation, and connected each and every creature with each other. So that today, if science tells us there are a hundred billion galaxies, and in each galaxy there are a hundred billion stars, yet all of these are connected with each other. They are in a system in a solar system like ours, and all of these galaxies put together, you know what is their purpose? To keep one planet alive. It's a life-giving system. And the one that makes this happen is the life-giving spirit. Now, that is the same in my whole body. My body would have different parts, different organs. Unless they are connected, they die. I would even die if something gets disconnected that is vital in my organs. So the Spirit is the life giver within me. And the Spirit is the life giver among each other. When we get disconnected, isolated from each other, we lose that kindredness. We lose that life giving Spirit with each other. So the Holy Spirit is that pervading presence, that indwelling presence of God in all of creation, in each human person, and for that matter, now the church. If that is true, the Holy Spirit is, in giving life, unifies all of us within the Father, the Son, and the Spirit, and in the mission of the Trinity for the whole world. If you wish to promote harmony, unity, especially in your families, have a devotion to the Holy Spirit. Seek the Holy Spirit. Ask His discerning love to make true your linkages, your connection with each other so that life may prevail. God bless you all.